Hello and welcome to another video tutorial. I'm Zach Schneff from Zach Schneff Photography and Photocascadia.com. Today I'm going to walk you through how to produce a time lapse video from still images in Lightroom. So I captured these just out my, my window, just doing a, a time lapse test here with an intervalometer with my 5D Mark II. So first thing I want to do, um, if you have multiple multiple sequences in a single folder, select the images uh, from one sequence and create a collection. In this case, I have only the images from this one sequence in this folder. So that's going to work just fine. One other thing you want to make sure while you're in library view here, go up to view and make sure that they're in ascending order. So the movie plays in the right direction. So there's a few things we want to do to prepare these images for video. So let's move to the develop module. And the first thing I'm going to want to do is crop to the HD aspect ratio. So I'll click on the crop tool and let's change this to 16 by 9 and then drag it wherever it looks best. Uh, that looks good so I'm going to hit return and the next thing I'm going to do is use the healing brush to get rid of a dust spot. That looks good. I'm going to hit return or done and let's continue. So I'm going to make a little white balance change here. Looks good. And you can make whatever change you want here. We're just going to sync these up. So I'm going to drag down the highlights a little bit. Everything else looks pretty good. So I'm going to leave it where it is. So once we do that, we want to sync up the rest of the images. So I want everything selected here. So I'll hit check all and synchronize. So once those are synced, I'm going to move over to the slideshow module. So I'll have a link to a zip file. There'll be a couple of uh, slideshow templates. And these are important when you're creating these time-lapse videos. So download the file, unzip it, and when you've done that, come back into Lightroom, and in the template browser here, right-click and hit Import. Then go find that folder, and what you're going to be looking for are these slideshow templates. And the ones I use are the 24 frame per second and the 29.97 frames per second. Those are two standards I typically use. So select the files that you're going to use. You can uh, just grab all of them if you want and hit import. I've already got them imported, so I will hit cancel. Then select the one that you want to use. In this case, I'll use the 24 frames per second. And with all of the frames selected, hit Export Video. I always choose the 1080p setting, and you can just put it wherever you want to. And uh, name it, in this case, we'll just call it TL1. And then you would hit Export and it'll take however many minutes it takes to uh, to render. Um, I've already done this so let's look at that file now. So once you're done, voila, here you go. You've got a time-lapse video. Pretty cool.